my loves and welcome back to my channel. I am super excited to finally be able to be doing my Halloween looks. Yay! So let's get started. I'm simply just using my NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk as my base for my eyeshadow. And I'm just going to take a yellow shade and I'm going to go underneath my brow bone. And then I'm going to go on top of that with a gold eyeshadow to give it a little bit more shimmer. And for this look, I am using the Juvia's Place Zulu palette. Um, but you can feel free to use whatever palette you have or switch up the colors, whatever you want. This is a really fun look, um, so do whatever you want. Go wild. Um, so I'm just going to take that orange shade and pack that on the rest of my eye. And then I'm going to go in with the red eyeshadow from that palette. And this is just going to add a little bit more depth, dimension, and color to the look. And I'm just going to go in with the purple shade from the Zulu palette. And I'm going to create lines on both sides of my eyes. And then I'm going to go in with the green shimmery shade that's in that palette and go right on top of that. And I'm just taking a makeup remover wipe to clean up that eyeshadow. I'm making sure that it's, you know, straight and crisp. And now I'm just going in with my foundation and for this look I'm using the CoverGirl Vitalist Healthy Elixir. But like I said before, I'm not really focused too much on products, just on how to get this look because I feel like it's a really cool look and it's really fun to do. Um, so yeah. Now I'm just going to highlight and I'm using my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. And I'm putting that in the usual places, underneath my eyes, on the bridge of my nose, chin, cupid's bow. Um, oh no, I skipped the cupid's bow. <laughs> but, I usually do that. Um, so yeah, forehead, chin, nose, under eyes, all that good stuff. And I'm just going to contour, because you can't have any makeup look, whether it's Halloween or not. You cannot not contour. So yes, um, I'm going to contour with the Black Opal Cream Stick Foundation in Hazelnut and blend that out. And to set my face, I'm using the Sasha Buttercup Setting Powder. But like I said before, you can use whatever you want. And I usually do not bake with this because I feel that it makes me kind of cakey. But I really wanted to make sure that my makeup was really set today. So I'm going to bake today, okay? And now I'm just dusting off that excess powder. And I'm going in with my Absolute New York Pro Bronzer to finish up my contour. And now for my favorite part, the dots. Um, so what I'm doing is taking my NYX Jumbo Pencil and Milk, and I'm just creating dots along the bridge of my nose. And I'm going to take that all the way up my forehead and also across my eyebrows. And while doing this, I learned that you have to kind of spin the pencil to get the dots to be the exact same shape. Because if you don't, you'll have like different shapes and it won't be as round and even. So... Yeah, just spin the brush, not the brush, but the pencil, just to make sure that your dots are even. And now I'm just going to go over the dots with some white face paint. I usually do the pencil first because it gives me an outline um, as to where to put the face paint. It makes it so much easier that way. But if you don't have any white face paint, it's okay. You can just use the jumbo pencil, um, but you want to make sure that you go over it. You set it with some sort of white eyeshadow to ensure that it lasts all day. And now for the famous lip line, I'm going to start at my cupid's bow with that same white face paint and I'm going to work it down my lips and then down my chin. And now I'm going to take the L'Oreal Infallible Paints and this is in number 306 and I'm going to just place that on my bottom lip. So I went ahead and applied my lashes off camera and now I'm just applying a faux lip ring and I applied a faux nose ring as well and this is pretty much the finished look you guys. I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and if you do recreate this look please tag me in it. I would love to see. Love you guys and I'll see you next time.